all of the uranium in the reactor was separated from the intensely radioactive fission products. I shall never forget my wonderment as I stood next to the unshielded steel cans containing the uranium that only a few days earlier had been mixed with millions of curies of radioactivity. We were particularly proud of this because that tiny chemical plant was large enough to decontaminate the core of a one gigawatt molten salt breeder. You know, in one respect, a machine is a machine, but I guess anybody who's involved in designs of things gets sort of emotionally wedded to one thing over another. And I think the molten salt breeder was probably the one thing that he really had uh, a feeling in his heart for. There's this hot idea about using molten salts. High temperature is probably easier than high pressure. That was one of the best decisions I made, I think, despite the fact that the project was eventually terminated. But I still think that, well, eventually people will come back to this reactor. 